Students put the pedal to the metal today for the annual Green Power USA Toyota Classic. The race happening at the Milton Frank Stadium. Our Kenesha Dees has a look at how students prepared for the race during the pandemic. More than 30 high school and middle school students put their engineering skills to the test on this track by using their F24 electric cars designed and built by them. It's kind of a it's still you still get that jolt of excitement when you're doing this. For many students, it's the first time experiencing the thrill of the race. Students from Huntsville, Madison City and County Schools, other parts of Alabama and students from Georgia were there too. I, I did the, all of the design on both of the cars. So I literally was in the hallway cutting material and duct taping. And their most favorite part? Driving. Most Working as a team also. Important because like if everybody's not chipping in, the project's not going to get done the way it needs to be. The goal is to drive for 90 minutes using one set of batteries to see who can go the furthest distance. Showing what kids our age can do with their creativity in their hands mm -hmm. and how we can create something that doesn't use gas. It can use batteries and it works just as well as a normal car would. For some students, it took between two and a half months to five months to build their cars, but they would experience some roadblocks due to COVID-19. I'd say one of the challenges is, is that it took so long just to do like one simple thing because we can only do one person in the hall at a time. The Green Power USA Toyota Classic is growing by the year. Leaders are looking forward to what's ahead. Before COVID, we had 25 events scheduled in the course of a year. The year before, we only had 14. So it's getting more and more popular, and we're just excited to see what it's doing across the nation. Putting the Valley first, Kenesha Dees, WZDX News.